No, but you're also a handyman, right? No, no, I'm also not really a man. No, like, no, no, but but I'm saying, but you were good before you no, went. No, I wasn't. That's the oh, thing. You didn't know like, how. At 36, really? I couldn't build a ramp for my kid's monster truck. Oh, oh I thought you were like raised. No, in the no, I was you knew doing, how to I do can, all this. I can do tree work, manual labor, stuff like that, but I don't know how to build a table. I don't know how to change. I don't know how to fix a faucet. Like not at all. Well, I mean, you could though. You just it's just research, really. Now I can. Yeah, I, yeah. I know how to learn. Yeah. You know, it's like. Like I can do a lot of high level shit because I learn how to learn. Like the, the, the skill is actually how to train yourself, find information, muscle memory. The skill isn't the skill. The skill is how to acquire skills. So it's like, that's why YouTube's a blessing. I'm not even against YouTube, even though they kick me off. Uh, Cause you can find out how to do anything on that shit. That, yeah, that'd be a great commercial for YouTube right there. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> and I'm they like, kicked me off, but I still recommend it. You can learn a lot of stuff on no, YouTube. No, I'm dead serious. I'm like, oh, I, I know. I It'd be crazy so if you got kicked off so much you couldn't even watch tutorials anymore. <laughs> They're like, oh, we they do. Do. <laughs> bro, my wife isn't allowed on Airbnb. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, I'm not allowed on PayPal, Venmo, Vimeo. Wow. Uh, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. It's like, oh my god, we're so oppressed. We're fat black people. It's like, dude, my wife. I've committed no crime. I have no criminal record, nothing, zip. My wife, for just being married to me, who, by the way, is half Hispanic. So it's like, oh, he's such a white supremacist. It's like, okay, my half Hispanic wife is not allowed to have an Airbnb account. And I'm not pandering at all. She's mostly white, in my opinion. You know, I look at the positives. <laughs> but it's like, you know, in my hat, you know, in my book, she's white. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so if you got if you have to do shows, do you where do you practice? Do you work out material anywhere? No, when I tape a special, it's the first time I've ever done any of it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you must be really being fucking locked in then. You know that's you know what's gonna kill, you know what to close with, but you have music, so you're gonna close with music, but well, it doesn't really matter. I mean, it's like this is what I have to say and it's almost like the exact opposite of pandering to the point where it's almost a little bad. I'm like, <laughs> dude, this is funny, whether you laugh or not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm taping oh, my yeah, special. It's the first time I'm doing it. I'm taping it. Yeah, that, my last special was like the fifth time I did it, maybe. it was. It's called, um, uh, what's it called? Not How Dare Me. It was... Uh, you're doing great, kid. It's at unauthorized.tv. People can watch that if they want. But I uh, taped it in a airport hangar because uh, I wasn't allowed in any theaters. I'd, I'd rent a theater. I'd, I'd you know, spend five grand, uh, rent it, sell it out, make a profit. And then the week of, they'd say, you're not allowed. You're, you're the bad man. You hate trans people. You know, I faced the actual bigotry that Chappelle lies about. Yeah. I, you know, I wasn't allowed in the manger. You know what I mean? So. Clubs that used to hang my picture on it, I'm not allowed. No theater, none of them. It's like, oh, you're such a baby. I'm like, dude, I'm having a great time. To the point where it motivated me to like start a network called the Great Bear Trail where I could perform in someone's barn or their own industrial space. or, And then it started building all this community. And now there's thousands of bears that uh, they now trade like goods with each other. They've started families. It's like they hire each other. It's ironically it's kind of like what the jews did under czar nicholas ii like a lot of uh business practices were outlawed by the czar and then under stalin and so they would start their own networks and that is now the capitalist system and so it's not even bad it's like an opportunity if 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 people make things that people want illegal there's going to be um a demand for it. like right now i've never seen more demand for comedy ever but like actual Americans are like, please say something true. We hate the newt, not the subway pushing. I'm not saying all the news is bad, <laughs> but, but in general, it's like people are dying for the truth. And it's like, or just anybody being funny. I'm not even saying I know all the truth. It's just like clearly obvious shit that now Chappelle is pretending 
to face persecution over when he he has five more Netflix specials coming. I was I'm not allowed to be in theaters where the week after they were doing Chippendales dancers because of jokes I did that now Chappelle is doing for money. Caitlyn Jenner is woman of the year, but hasn't been a woman for a full year. <laughs> Caitlyn Jenner was voted woman of the year. Her first year as a woman. This is who I feel bad for, because you got the LBGT, right? Yeah. There, there's more every day right now. But I'll tell you when it happened. You know, you hear all those letters together all the time. LBGT, LBGT. It all started with the L's. Of course, next to the G's in the passenger seat is the L's. Oh, great. And then the B's came in. The B's threw people for a loop, because you never really know if you can go camping with them, but they're cool. <laughs> Like, you know, they're like, well, bang anybody. They're like, anybody? They're like, anybody. If it's one thing that the L's and the G's agree on, is that the B's are fucking gross. <laughs> they seem greedy to the L's and the G's, you know what I mean? They're just sitting in the back seat like, yeah, man, I'll fuck anybody in this car. What's going on, man? It's like... It's yeah, I think I think Chappelle thing is like black privilege, because if he was white, I think he would get he would be getting in a lot more trouble. But again, like if you're if you're black, if you're gay, you have you have a little you buy yourself uh, the ability to to say shit and not get into trouble. Like people can say I'm wrong, but I'm not wrong. Like I just see it in comedy clips. Like if, if you're a woman, if you're gay, you have a limp you're black it, you they just get if you're just a white dude saying stuff they they're like no thank you and that's also why why uh, a lot of comics pander because you know you're not allowed to say stuff as a white guy but but if you were I black just huh? i just do yeah you do you do yeah. but 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 you have to you're milking a goat too so it's like you do stuff a lot of people don't want to do <laughs> Crack and meth. So you're you're basically canceled from everything. So is it a relief to not be on Twitter and everything? And and yeah, so well, we just made all our own stuff. I mean, I have my own streaming platform. It's uh, unauthorized.tv and unbearablesmedia.com is where I, we put all of our community's cartoons and all that. And um, yeah, I mean, it's it's cool. And then I have people run sites for me because I'm not. I can have someone else run uh, a uh, a handle on on my behalf. Like my buddy Cod, who was talking to you guys on Twitter. I'm not a lot on yeah. Twitter, but you know, I have people that can be on Twitter for me. <laughs> I'm like, I'm getting all mobbed up. It's so funny. I understand <laughs> how the mob works. It's like when you get in a situation where you just have other people do everything, it's because you're not allowed to. Right. You know, you have some godfather who's like, my friend is going to come over with a package. It's like, why can't you come over? Because I've been kicked off fucking YouTube. <laughs> but it also really spawns you to uh to create more you know my p.o box is where people could send like funds to help get this shit built and it, it works great yeah, people like, don't people send you like gold and stuff not gold but like silver coins sometimes and shit some yeah uh seeds they hand make me a lot of stuff uh hand handmade you know knitted hat like half that shit behind me is all like that, for people that say i'm anti-semitic by the way that american flag was sent from a jew in israel his uh his dad uh got it in world war one and then they moved back to israel and so i just make fun of everybody and if people think making fun of jews means you're anti-semitic they don't understand comedy it's just like and i'm not going to explain it every time well yeah hey, why did why did the guy send you the flag uh because he likes me he thinks i'm funny yeah, but it, but he's uh, but he bought it in Israel. The, the no, American no, that flag? was his grandfather's flag for serving in the American military in World War One. Oh, and uh, and then they moved back. Like um, after World War Two, they all emigrated to Israel, and he's kept it this whole time. And he uh, he was like, "Oh, you're my favorite American," or something. Like basically, like he wanted me to have it. And uh, like beautiful shit like that happens all the time. Like if you look around there, like that, like that's a handmade axe. All that stuff's handmade. You know, people write have written books about me. They've like published books about my story and stuff, like a lot of art. 
these bears were all sent to me. You know, that's why it's like, oh, you're a cult leader. I'm like, dude, I fucking someone sent me the bear. It's, I love I love it, but I'm not like, you know, culting up. 